What's good guys, welcome back to Bitcoin Beats, my name is Hamilton, this is a new series, we're going to do an altcoin of the month thing here, so anything I feel that's new in the cryptosphere, anything I feel that's kind of uh, changing the game a little bit, maybe leading the pack, creating a new trend here, uh, that other projects, other protocols, coins will follow, um, I will be putting in here as kind of like a, a gem of the month or whatever we want to call this, right? Uh, so, today is Moonpot, okay, Moonpot is an interesting project and it's something that uh, I've not seen before and I actually came up with some this idea when I was drunk at a Christmas party last year I'm glad someone pulled it off I'm glad someone did it um, I feel like it's a good start for a potential new genre in uh, the DeFi and crypto industry right so what this is it's essentially like a raffle right so uh, if if you normally if in, in a like a protocol a yield kind of DeFi thing, right? Normally, you're going to stake what you've got, okay? You're going to be earning yield over a certain amount of time, right? Um, and then after that, you can unstake it with your profits or take your profits out and restake it and compound uh, all of that stuff, right? In this case, what Moonpot does is slightly different here uh, in the sense that it will basically take a protocol that's staking something, uh, for example, they're using Beefy, right? So Beefy uh, that has a vault, uh, where you basically stake your cake, you get your yield, uh, and then you can like auto compound it on beefy, or you can take it out or whatever, right? So what this does, it basically generates that yield using those protocols on beefy, uh, and then it splits it up into either the pots, uh, and as well as that, the people that staked it as well, right? I think it's 50% or something like that goes into the pots uh, where you can win it, right? People can win it if they stake into those pots and then the other 50% goes to the person that were originally staked it, right? So uh, with this, you can see that these pots have got ridiculous. People seem to like this kind of, uh, this, uh, I don't want to say it's, well, technically it is gambling, but you're not really risking anything, right? You're only really risking uh, what you were normally risking before, which is, let's say, your cake or your pots here. Uh, if the price of those plummet, then yeah, you're going to lose money. But if you were staking them anyway, uh, that would happen anyway, right? So in this case, what this does, it basically gives you the chance to win a lot more in terms of yield uh, than you would normally if you were kind of building up your small stack, right? Uh, so with this new dynamic, I think this is super appealing. I feel like People, I mean, you can see these guys are on, what, 92 million TVL right now. Uh, last time I checked, this, this was 60, so this is still going up massively, okay? Uh, and that's going to be great for POTS, the coin that's obviously behind this. Uh, and it's going to be great for everything, uh, everyone that's kind of staking anyway, right? Uh, so you can see pretty good APY, pretty good stuff happening here. Uh, and the main, the main point I want to talk about here is this Ziggy's pot, right? So this is a monthly draw. Uh, this thing is growing massively uh, it's been going up and down from like a mil to like 700k or something so uh, what this does in itself what the lotteries are guys is uh, this one will give uh, once a month it will give basically this prize pool to 10 winners right it will split this prize pool up uh, and give it to 10 people uh, so 10 people or 10 wallets here uh, will essentially get 87k right that's a lot of cheddar. That's money right there uh, for potentially staking. Uh, and you can see here, right, your odds aren't that bad either. You've got one in 3,000 uh, for a thousand buck deposit, right? So if, uh, I think I have like uh, like six and a half K staked in mine. So, so I think it's, yeah, I've got like a one in 500 chance. That's pretty good uh, to win potentially almost a hundred K here if this did get to a million in the next four days, which I'm pretty sure it may. Um, yeah, if it does do that, one in one in five hundred is great odds, right? That's that's serious money there if, if you do win. And if not, it's absolutely fine as well, right? Uh, I want to talk about the way they stop people just kind of going into the lotteries and then uh, taking taking their money out anyway, and basically keeping people staked for uh, and giving that that incentive to keep it staked uh, over a long period of time, right? And what they do here is essentially have a fair play cost, right? So if you were to just deposit and then withdraw as soon as that lottery is done, uh, then what you're going to do is you're going to have to pay 2.5%, in some cases up to 5% here, um, if you 
basically unstake from that point, right? If you do it 10 days before, and again, this is a monthly draw, so you could stake uh, and then you, your fair play time is good and you can withdraw at any time, right? And then you just wait for that at the, at the end of the month. Cool. Uh, do the lottery you want to get out then. That's absolutely fine, right? Uh, but if it's before that 10 day period, guys, you're going to have a, you're basically going to have to pay 2.5%. And that sounds bad, but it's not bad, right? It's going to keep the, the price fairly stable. It's going to give people a reason to keep it staked and it's going to make the coin go up over time, right? So that's essentially the fundamentals behind this. I do think this is a great project, a great idea. Uh, it's going to be generating similar yield to you would to what you would do in beefy right um and i will actually put on the screen right now while i'm talking here guys i'm gonna put on the screen uh, basically how you deposit how you buy it on, from pancake swap and then how you deposit it um into the pots and also how to compound it as well right so that will be on the screen while i'm talking right now uh, and at the same time here let's talk about this chart this chart's an interesting one this is obviously uh from uh, from pucon because they're not on any exchanges yet but they're already worth 13 uh, bucks here, which is incredible, right? To, to have a run like this, to even have a chart like this on PooCoin is very, very rare. Like a lot of the, the new coins will do stuff like this, maybe something like this, right? Uh, really random walks here. Uh, but this thing seems to be doing fantastically in terms of the structure. Uh, and you can see here, there's still a, a lot here that we can bounce off of after this kind of pullback as well, right? But the main point here that I wanted to talk about here for the price side of things, uh, and this is kind of bringing me to essentially uh, the trade rating, right? So the trade rating I'm going to give for this is 7, 7, what was it? <laughs> 7.6 here. So 7.6 is my trade rating for this. If it's above a 7, it's pretty good rating. If it's below a 7, it's kind of like okay, but there's going to be better coins to trade, right? And if it's above an 8, it's going to be like your blue chips, kind of like your cake or your any, any of your big project coins, right? The mid to high caps are going to be typically okay for trading, right? Uh, but what I think that's different about this in terms of trading and in terms of investing, as we'll get to in a minute, uh, is the these draws, right? These draws are going to happen at certain periods of time, meaning that you can expect uh, basically a reoccurring price action every week and every month based on these. And there's also a community one here, uh, if you did feel a, bit, a little bit more degenerate. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't really trade banana. I heard this thing does well. But uh, yeah, I mean, this this is also an option as well. I believe they do this uh, every, was it? Is it every week? I don't know. I don't know this one. But this one has 15 winners, you can see, right? So if you want slightly better odds, then there you go. That's cool. You can see 1,000 buck deposit. You're going to have way real low odds here, 251, right? So that's pretty good. Uh, but the main pots are really the ones I'm in. I'm not actually in the banana one. Um, because I feel like cake's pretty stable. And I feel like pots is a long way to go up. That's a personal opinion, not financial advice here. Uh, but yeah, I feel like it's, it's okay to be staking these generally uh, and leaving it, right? So uh, with that, we can see here with uh with this chart essentially as long as we're above 10 here for me i'm pretty happy for this thing and obviously i got in way low i got into like six and this thing's done a run since and uh, it basically did this run due to a weekly draw as well right so uh this is basically what i'm saying right you can expect good wide price action here uh, on the way up uh, based on for example a draw ending people selling off with their winnings right uh, or or running up to a draw you could expect a, a bit more in the demand side of things, right? Uh, especially before we get on exchanges, before we get on Binance, stuff like that, right? Uh, something like this could do really, really interesting things with each draw that comes along, right? Um, I get a lot of questions here, like when when is these coins releasing on Binance? I see this in so many Telegram groups. Uh, you don't always want to be on exchanges, guys, right? It is obviously gonna push a bit of a, a, a boost in demand, um, an ease, an ease of, of, of buying, I guess, for some people, uh, but, uh, that's not always a good thing. It means the whales can easily get involved and start manipulating it, right? Uh, which will be still interesting because you're going to want to stake it, really, if you're doing anything with this coin. Uh, so, yeah, this, this is going to be quite good, quite volatile here, uh, and hopefully quite healthy in, in the future uh, as it progresses. And, again, it's got that backing from Beefy. Beefy's a very trustworthy kind of platform here for the staking. Um, so, yeah, the, the creators of Beefy created this. It's still a pretty trustworthy thing. And this is one of the reasons why I'm covering this, right? I wouldn't cover anything if, if I don't, I'm not too sure about the devs behind it, right? Uh, so we've got that. And... Um, what else here? If you, if you are new to the channel, you know what to do. You know what to do. <laughs> and we do mainly just TA here on this channel, but I will be doing this every month. So feel free to subscribe if you would like a bit more. And let me know in the comments what you, uh, you want to do here. And you will probably see on the video at this point uh, that basically I've uh, I bought, I think I bought however many. Did I buy three or four? <laughs> I, I, I wanted to give away like 50 bucks of those. Um, 
to, to one lucky viewer. So just leave a comment and I'll just pick one of the comments and I'll send you like 50 bucks worth of pots. Okay, guys? Cool. We good here? Apart from that, guys, if we're looking at the tokenomics here, uh, it's pretty standard setup here. You've got rewards uh, in terms of anvils here hanging over the anvil kind of rating. I feel like this is fairly safe. Naturally, if a lot of people buy it or a lot of people winning, losing, whatever, uh, they're going to have that anvil hanging over the price, which means they can essentially not like rug, but uh, it can cause a lot of if, if they want to exit for example uh, it could cause some volatility but then again people are going to want to be buying this up to kind of uh, take take over the odds of the yield right so again very interesting in terms of the uh the trading side but from my investment rating i've actually got a 7.2 here so it's pretty good it's a little too early here uh i may make another video basically saying whether this is still good but yeah it's a little too early here to really say it's a great investment uh i i got in pretty pretty low right i got in pretty low so i'm happy for this to mess around here uh, and I, st I still do think it goes up here personally again this isn't financial advice just speculation but i would probably say uh, i'm expecting maybe maybe 40 maybe 40 dollars here we'll see how it goes um and we'll see kind of the momentum it goes and obviously if bitcoin's trashing it down here this is going to do a similar thing uh but generally here i'm pretty happy with this and i think uh i think it's going to do well over time here so that's essentially it that's that's moon pots if you have an opinion on this let me know if you want uh, another coin done here Feel free, drop me a message uh, or drop it in the comments and I'll see if I can get it done for next month. But this is my altcoin of the month here. Uh, you can also see all of the previous winners. You can go check it out uh, on a kind of a blockchain in itself, right? So you can see all of these people that have won it, just how much they've won uh, to see that it's a real thing, right? And I, I believe they do have ordered but they've been audited as well. They're waiting for the audits to come back in. Uh, so yeah, all of this will always be here. And uh, yeah, pretty trustworthy project, trustworthy devs. Uh, again, from Beefy, pretty happy with this. Um, and it's definitely something I'll be holding for the foreseeable future at least, right? As this thing continues to grow, right? Uh, just for spec speculation here, sorry, just for, what's the word here? <laughs> just for uh, general stuff here. Let me, is this gonna work? Hang on. Um, if, I'm just trying to see the TVL here. Yeah, so 540 million here on Beefy that is uh, like a year old. To, however, pretty old here, pretty established. Uh, and then if we go back to... Where is this thing? <laughs> where is this gone? Oh, yeah, if we go back to Moonpot, uh, already at 92 million, right? Uh, so that's interesting as hell. That's, uh, that's definitely something that's grown massively in a month and she'll continue to grow because people like to win those prizes, right? So that's going to be it. That's going to be the video. Have a fantastic one. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out and goodbye from Bitcoin Beats.